In the end, I think the our hero character is inside the black hole. We come to understand this. And he has access to a timeline that wouldn't otherwise be available to him. And he sees his daughter's bookshelf. Uh, he's no longer inside the black hole. Where is he? When he gets inside the black hole, he is scooped up by a spacecraft that was built by this advanced civilization that provided the wormhole uh, to him and to humanity. And it's called the Tesseract. Tesseract is a four dimensional cube, four spatial dimensions. And that's why in there you saw, I guess, the past and future all yeah. kind of simultaneously. It's all, all related to it, the it felt very higher dimensional. Yeah, so that's right. It goes out of the uh, black hole. Not through the horizon, it can't do that. It goes oh, up through the fourth dimension, in, in, up through the fourth space dimension, yeah. or what's called the fifth dimension in the movie. Sure. This time is the fourth dimension and goes back to Earth.